great privilege to be leading the, on the May Day March here in Belfast. A fantastic uh, turnout, it's a wonderful day. We've got the fantastic Dublin Fire Brigade pipe band at the front of the march, it's a great day. Well, it's our centenary, so uh, need to have a good sh turnout. Um, show the people that they're willing to get out, face the cuts. We're just out here today just to show solidarity to all the unions in Northern Ireland. And we've got a good turnout from all the brigades in Region 2. Like, I'm very happy to be here. And thankfully, the weather's quite good as well. I retired in October. I'm glad to get my 30 years over. When I joined in 1987, we were kitted out with rubber leggings and yellow leggings and stuff like that there. So you sort of understood then you were getting into fires with this. The, your personal protection equipment wasn't what it was meant to be and uh, and through the years I've seen the, the tunics, the, the fire kit we've got, the type of breathing apparatus that, that's been, everything's been upgraded and, and, I've, and I've seen the way things have improved so I'm delighted to come out and support the FBU. bedrock of what we're about is solidarity. This year we have the 100th anniversary of the FBU, we have also the 100th anniversary of the Bank Union, FSU, we have the 150th anniversary of the IMTO. It's important to remember these things but, but I think it's really important and more important to plan for the future uh, so that we can be stronger, so that we can meet the challenges of today and the future. Same values but different tools uh, are needed. One of the reasons why I'm here today is because I believe in the public sector, I believe in hands-on uh, response to the front line when people are in trouble. I think that needs to be supported. I think it needs to be funded properly, and that's uh, that's why I'm here today to show my support. Yay!